Hello friends, how are you? And welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, welcome. Very happy to have you here. Back at it again with another amazing Shein haul. We've got a few dresses, lots of jackets, and a couple of accessories. So if you're interested in seeing what I picked up, stay tuned. Big thank you and shout out to the team at Shein for gifting me these pieces. I really appreciate it. And I'm just going to say that this may be one of my favorite hauls ever. I have so much to go through, so we'll get started here in just a second. But all of the items that I show you will be linked down below with the corresponding size that I try on. So you can kind of compare your measurements or your body type to mine. I am like a 3X or a US size 24 pretty standardly with most brands. So most of the pieces that I picked up today are in the 4X in Shein, which is actually a US size 20. But I like look at the fabric content, I pay attention to the silhouette, and I usually have really good luck. All right, and without further ado, let's just get started off with a banger. I love this dress, okay? I know it's kind of unique. Like, look at the sleeves, like 80s bay called and she wants her dress back, but I'm kind of living for it. I also really love the horizontal stripes. I think it's so cute, but my favorite part of this dress, you guys already know, is like this mermaid trumpet hemline. I just feel like this to be so, so flattering on like my body type in particular. So if you're more of like a uh, pear shape or an hourglass shape, this type of like bodycon style that flares out of the bottom, I feel just like looks so, so good. And so I always look for silhouettes that have this type of finish. This is a really stretchy like bodycon dress. Full disclosure, I'm not wearing any shapewear underneath of this, so I would likely wear something with a little bit of control just to kind of smooth me out more, but um, this is such a comfortable dress. I did not want to like ruin it by having to wear shapewear, if you know what I mean. Really stretchy, kind of like that nice ribbed material. Three quarter length sleeve here. The length is perfect on me. Um, I love this kind of like high, low, front, back style. And again, the sleeve here, the shoulder is just super unique and very like retro, which I think is great. You know, like the 90s are coming back. Let's just take it back a little bit further to the 80s. And this will be like the best dress for the job. <laughs> you guys, like stop it with this jacket. I am obsessed with this. When I saw it online, I knew it was just gonna have to come home to me. I mean, it's my mauve like dusty pink, dusty rose color. It's like frilly. Oh, it's just so good. It's so good. I actually don't mind it with this dress too. Like the color story I think plays off well. This one doesn't have any stretch and there is kind of like that silk lining. So like really no stretch, but I actually don't have any problems with this one. Um, even in like the shoulders and the arms. And I have that dress on that has kind of like that padded shoulder moment. So I actually have plenty of room in here, which is nice. I think this is so chic. Now this is definitely not like a jacket you can wear every day. Don't get me wrong, but I do think that this can absolutely make a statement. Pair this with like a little black dress or like a silk slip dress and oh my gosh, what a statement you will make. I cannot wait to style this one. It is so soft. Like I can't quit petting myself. It's so soft. And I just love how like movement friendly it is. And I'm like loving this probably more than I should, but what can I say? I'm obsessed. <laughs> Next up we have this ultra cozy like super thick like sherpa fleece jacket this thing is incredibly soft and incredibly warm like i just put this on and i'm already like oh my gosh i need to take this off <laughs> it is so cozy though so the inside is this white cream color the outside is like this tan more of like a camel tan shade and the whole thing is like sherpa fleece just so cozy so so cozy there's not any like belt or anything, so it just kind of hangs open, which I don't mind. It's plenty long, plenty big. It has pockets so you can stick your snacks and your phone in there. You know, we love it. I honestly think that I will just like 
stay cozy up in this all winter long. This is like the perfect lounge piece for me, like to throw over my PJs or like some like athleisure just to like have an extra cozy layer. I am obsessed. When I tell you this thing is like ridiculously soft, you're probably not gonna wanna take it off of your body. It is that soft, so cozy. I don't really see myself wearing this like outside of the house like as a jacket jacket but inside this is going to be like the coziest thing I think I put on my body all season and I'm so excited for that. I'm obsessed. I would actually prefer it to have like a belt just so I have something to like keep the warmth in but I'm not mad about it. I love this. What do you guys think? <laughs> Next up are a couple of handbags. So the last few hauls, I've been opting to get a couple of handbags just to kind of check out the accessory line from Shein, and these do not disappoint. Check this baddie out, she is super cute. This is really nice quality. Like this top part is kind of like a faux suede and then faux leather kind of throughout the rest of it. I love like the ring style handle and then like this whole like seatbelt style strap I think is super cute. She's gonna hold, you know, a decent amount of things in there. Definitely more of like a event-based bag. Probably not one that I would use every day because your girl has a lot that she keeps in her purse. But if I'm going out for the night or like going, you know, on a girl's day or something, I would absolutely grab for this. It's so cute. And the quality on this is actually really, really nice. There are rivets at the bottom, so you know, your bag's not gonna touch the ground if you put it down. Just really well constructed. And then this one is super cute too. Like check her out. She is kind of like this textured bag with this gold chain in the front. A magnetic clasp closure here that opens up into this bag. Now you can hold it in your hand like this or it does come with a strap. However, you don't need to use it if you don't want to. I will say that this one isn't nearly as nice of quality as this one just because the hardware here is definitely plastic. Um, you can kind of hear it rattle a little bit. So I would say like between the two of them, this one definitely feels more expensive than this one but I think this one is super like fashion forward and trendy so you know yin yang <laughs> this next piece is the only thing that I couldn't try on for you and I'm so sad because I think it's really beautiful I love this kind of just like delicate floral embroidered top and then pleated bottom in this mustardy yellow like golden yellow color that I love however this one um, has no stretch and so when it hit the bodice, like there was just no way I could get it down over my hips, um, which is too bad, but you know, it happens. I think that this is really, really pretty if you have like a semi-formal event. I definitely think that you could dress this up, yet you could wear this, you know, for like girls brunch, church day, I don't know. You can still wear it pretty casually, but I love that it does have the flexibility to be a lot more formal than it appears. And it's super lightweight, um, so definitely not gonna be like a super hot, overpowering dress. You may actually need to wear a lining underneath of it or a slip, just because the, the material does seem a little sheer. I haven't, like I said, been able to try it on to test that out myself, but if you're in the market for a dress like this, I think she's a beauty. Just know you're probably gonna wanna wear a slip underneath of it. Next up is another like Sherpa fleece style jacket, but this one I think definitely has more of like that outerwear vibe with the toggle closure here. I will say that this feels a little oversized. So like you can see in the front, like I have extra room and it's not really like super closed, if you know what I mean. It also doesn't have pockets, which I'm pretty bummed about, but you know, not a deal breaker. I do like the jacket style, it has a hood. Super soft and cozy, just like the other one I showed you, like that really cozy, warm Sherpa material. I like that it does have this cuff sleeve at the bottom. And I do like kind of the color story here with the black and the brown. I just think it's good for fall, very, you know, warm, neutral story of my life. <laughs> I love it. 
I think that this is really cute. You could even wear it on toggled like so. I would actually probably opt to wear it open just because I feel like it looks like it fits me a little bit better. It looks a little too oversized when I have it toggled. Um, but you guys tell me, what do you think? I think she's cute. This next jacket is another like retro throwback. I think it's so cute. It reminds me of something that like Kelly Kapowski would have worn on Saved by the Bell. If you know what I mean, I'm obsessed. So cute. It's just this like cute little like bomber style jacket. I have it kind of hiked up just because I feel like it fits me better at my natural waist than down here on like my hip. Um, so I like to just kind of pull it up and let it do its thing. I have it paired with just a standard black dress that I absolutely love. This is from Shein as well. If it's still available, I will link it down below, but it's absolutely one of my go-to black dresses because you can dress it up or dress it down. Point, case in point here with um, this jacket, I feel like this jacket helps to tone this down a little bit, so I love it. There's not much stretch in this jacket, like in the material, so like in the arms, I don't have any issues, but just keep that in mind. Um, there's a stretchy waistband here though, and fully zipper operation here. You can also wear this just hung open. However, I feel like I like to have a little bit more definition to show off my waist a little bit more, so I would likely wear it zipped up, but you have the flexibility to do so. Sleeve length is great. I love this print. Again, another retro vibe that I can definitely get behind. Check out this next jacket. I think this is so cute. I'm super sad that it doesn't fit me well enough though to like zip up, but you know, it's fine. I actually like it hung open too. It's got nice deep pockets in the front and the print is so perfect for this time of the year and then also into spring. I think that this would be a great jacket to have. Now the inside is like that fleecy, fuzzy lining, but it is stretchy to a degree, like not super stretch, but to a degree, it's not like a uh, silk lining, if you know what I mean. So it's super fuzzy. It does zip up, however, <laughs> I got these hips that don't lie, so, you know, she just won't let me be great, but it's fine. Um, I could probably get it as far as, like, here, and then, well, as far as, like, like here, and then it would not go up. But that's fine, you know, like I said, I like it hung open as well. I think it's a really great length, um, especially if you're a taller gal. Like, this actually fits me long enough that it doesn't look, like... I'm trying too hard to like find a jacket that's supposed to be long but doesn't hit me long, you know what I mean? So if you're taller, I think that this is a great, great option. The sleeve length is nice as well for any of your taller ladies out there. We love it. And overall, I just think it's a cute jacket. Again, can't zip it up, but it does have some potential just hung open. What do you all think? Remember how I said earlier that I'm obsessed with this Shein dress because you can really dress it up or down? This is what I'm talking about. Look at what this jacket does to this dress. Like, okay, this jacket is absolutely fantastic, though. Let's just talk about the jacket. We're not here for the dress. We're here for the jacket. Let's be real. She is sequined. She is colorful. She is just retro vibes. I love this so much. <laughs> it is so cute. Now, you probably can't tell on camera, but the jacket itself is almost like this velvet velour with the sequins sewn into it. So, we all know I love like textile texture mixing and this does not disappoint. I like it, kind of um, zipped up here like a blousier fit, but I also do enjoy it just hung open and letting it live its best life. Very stretchy. Very stretchy, good waistband here at the bottom, plenty of room in the arms. This is, again, giving me some retro vibes, but I'm not mad about it. I think this would be so cute for like a New Year's Eve party or a holiday party or something like that where you can wear sequins and it's like, you know, no one bats an eye at it. I absolutely love this so much. I can't wait to style this. She's a winner to me. And this last piece has me feeling like such a Victorian baddie. Check this dress out. First of all, there's so much detail to this dress. There's a lot going on. And so like this is definitely a statement piece. Definitely not something I'd probably grab for every day, but she is absolutely beautiful. The sleeves here are fully like floral lace. 
totally see-through, very billowy. We love that. The bottom of this dress is kind of like a shark bite style with that same lace bottom to the hem. It's so beautiful. The bodice of this dress is fully sheer lace. So like you can likely see my strapless bra under here. So just know like you're gonna need to wear some kind of undergarment <laughs> for the top. Otherwise, you know, your lady bits will show. So um, not really sure what I would pair underneath of this yet, but um, lots of ideas, lots of ideas. I think this is absolutely stunning. Like there's a lot of movement down here and I don't mind it. It is a teeny bit like snug under the bust here. There's not any stretch in this dress whatsoever. So that is, uh, you know, likely where I ran into issues, but it's okay. Like it's passable. I can, I can absolutely pass with it. Um, I think that this is just such a beautiful piece. One that I would never have expected to see on the Shein website, to be completely honest. And I'm just so happy I got to try it on. She's beautiful. I don't have a single thing in my closet like this. And that has me really excited to just play around with this. I really haven't seen anything like this out there this season either. Like this is just so unique to me. And it's really hard, especially as a plus size person, to find really unique pieces that aren't everywhere else. And this is just that so i'm so thrilled i got to try it what do you guys think i think she's stunning and that is everything that i picked up from my most recent shein haul i hope you've enjoyed this i think that this was a major success i had so much fun trying these pieces on because they were all like so unique and different and lots of like sparkle and lace and things that i just normally don't try out lots of jackets so overall huge success in my book. I always love to hear from you, so let me know down below what your favorites were, if this has inspired you to check any of these out for yourself, and what you are most interested in shopping for this season. I love to know like what trends you're looking out for and what things you already have in your shopping cart, so let me know down below. Big thank you and shout out again to the Shein team for gifting me these pieces. I really appreciate it. I do also have a coupon code with them that you can use at checkout to save an extra 15% off of your entire order. You just use the code Q3Sherry and that's going to save you 15% on your entire Shein purchase, making things that are already very affordable even more affordable. Thank you so much again for tuning in and being here. I really, really appreciate it. And I will be sure to see you in the next one. Take care.